I work from home and I have done for a long time and uh, I contract to other companies and I like it that way. I like uh, uh, the freedom. I like to be able to uh, do what I want when I want. I think uh, a couple more people where I work are working from home these days. It makes sense. They miss out on the commute. They can do the same things. So yeah, I think it's a good solution. If I use my own firm as an example, we are rammed for space. So people who are able to work from home, there is definitely you know, there is the opportunity to do that. Most people, um, when they first start, in my experience, working from home, they have the rigid working hour, um, you know, the nine to five sort of thing, and they feel guilty about walking away from the desk and stuff. But I think after time, and uh, with myself certainly now, um, for me it's about completing, doing what I have to do, and completing that, and then I can do whatever I like. And I don't have to travel. I live in Cambridge. I don't have to travel an hour and a half um, from London back home and do the whole commuting thing. I can just go and go out fishing and all the things I, I like to do in my spare time. I'm just, well, I'm not knowing anything. I mean, I think it's nice if they've got something to do and they prepare for sort of like a conference the next day. They can actually get more, you know, more done at home and they actually come to work because it's too much hassle. So in practicality, they actually will be ready in all terms to actually have that conference ready and all them details ready uh, rather than sort of do it at work and you just can't get, get uh, all, all your work done. We obviously have an open door policy at work so if I'm working on Project X there'd be people working on Project Y and Z would repeatedly come into the room ask questions and you have to multitask repeatedly um, while you're doing that whereas at home I suppose the time I spend with my wife is quite precious and so to that extent if I set aside two hours to really do work then I would do it solidly so I mean if anything I would say that uh, I work from home uh, infrequently, but when I do work from home, the productivity is as good, if not better. My personal opinion is it's better to keep the, the business side of things away from family. But then with the, the cost of transport and the, 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 like the gridlock, and I think that spoils everything. So in, in a way, it necessitates working from home. Networking um, and uh, everyone's got a broadband connection basically now. Um, I think that it, it becomes very, very easy. And I, I know my wife sort of uh, has started working from home and also works uh, in an office. And she's, uh, uh, she's uh, um, it took a technical guy to come over and set it up for her. But it is almost like she's in the office. All her email arrives as normal and everything arrives. It, it, she may as well be in a little office somewhere. It could be anywhere. I, mean, I don't usually work from home. The reason for that is that I think um, uh, I do financial services, regulatory law, so it's a lot of kind of white collar uh, work, um, commercial practices, commercial fraud, um, alleged practices of market abuse, insider dealing, anti-money laundering and so on and so forth. And so uh, it's important to really talk to the client at length and talk to other fellow practitioners to really understand the fact patterns before you really advise for which reason it is important for me to be close to the client and close to other fellow uh, lawyers within the firm. There's the practical aspects to it. It enables people, if they're commuting long distances, to two, two and a half hours in the case of one of my colleagues, then it gives them the flexibility. Um, but there is also an element from an employer's perspective, I suspect, where if there are people working from home, uh, are they actually really part of the team? Um, can you rely on them perhaps to do as much work as they would do with their, as if they were sitting at their desk? It's the socialising and um, the, the isolation part of it. Uh, and I get that, you know, I video Skype and so I, I try with all my customers, I try and have face-to-face um, -face video conversations and that sort of thing. But uh, that is the big disadvantage. And also some people worry about um, uh, falling out of the networking loop if you like, because, you know, sort of informal conversations and that help. And that's one of the things that I have to do. That's why I'm here now, you know, so I have to have lunches and I have to make an effort to do that. I prefer it that way, though, because then it's under my control. I think a happy medium, you know, working from home a few days and coming into work a few days, because you do miss out on a lot of stuff, especially if you sort of open plan office, get to, you know, network with other people. If there are people working from home, uh, are they actually really part of the team? Um, can you rely on them perhaps to do as much work as they would do with their, as if they were sitting at their desk? Hands-on mobile connection like Blackberries or cell phones which are already prevalent and of course online connection through laptops or desktops uh, which allow a person to be available at home while he or she is working there is one indication that actually work is going on. Um, and the other thing of course is work product. Uh, I mean the proof of the pudding is in the eating. So, I mean, if after a day at home, working at home, the person comes back with a very well-crafted memorandum uh, or a good client note, then it's evident that the person has worked from home. I'm more productive. I, I think I'm more productive because there is the slight air of 
paranoia of, um, oh my God, I've got to, you know, what am I going to do next? How, how is that going to work? And so I, I, I try and always uh, expe exceed the expectations on me. Um, I think it, it's easy, you know, sort of uh, uh, maybe for some people to uh, fall away and, and be less productive. But at the end of the day, you know, if you've got a job to do, it's what you can see. So, you know, so someone says they want a job done by Friday. If it's not done, you know that you haven't been doing your work. So I'm all for it.